Hey my good people, it's me, I'm Alex. Thank you, thank you, thanks. Hey what's up Canvas, what's up everyone, how's it going? Did everyone get a snack between It's Me, I'm Alex episodes? I got a snack. I had a, um, a chicken pot pie, and it was pretty good. Tractor had a snack. You mean like, because you went and you were the snack? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> we gotta work on not being so weird. It's hard to not be weird sometimes. But it's okay to be weird, right? Yeah. Yeah. I know I'm weird. And I know that we're weird. And everything is about this is weird. Hey, Liddy. Good to see you. Liddy and Canvas are here. I wanted to give a shout out to my mod team because I have a really great mod team. And while I was about to clap, double clap for the mod team. Like, yeah. I love my mods, and, oh, there we go, you got me, you got back from the store, nice, no, I, the mods here at It's Me, I'm Alex, you know, first of all, I'm so very thankful that, like, the people who watch my show, like, for the most part, like, we don't have a whole bunch of buttholes watching the show, do we? No. Which is kind of crazy, like, because we're on the internet, and there's, like, a lot of buttholes on the internet, but I've been, like, super friggin' lucky that, like, they don't watch It's Me, I'm Alex. Like, something about this show just repels buttholes, like, 24 hours a day, so, like, I don't know. We might want to have, like, scientists look into it, because, like, if you've got a problem with buttholes in your life, like, just put on this show and, like, it, they don't go away, because... I mean, we don't get a lot of buttholes around here, and I know I keep saying butthole a whole bunch, but like, I mean, I can, I mean, this is a, an adult car cartoon, I can say asshole, I try not to curse a whole lot, but I curse sometimes just because, you know, I can, I guess. I don't know. It's okay to say cuss words. They're just words. But I try to only use them for emphasis and stuff, I guess. Wait, what's, what was I talking about? I think you were talking about buttholes? No, I was talking about my mods. But. Oh yeah, like, you know, we don't have a whole bunch of buttholes watching the show so the mods don't have to like, you know, they can enjoy the show too, they don't have to like delete posts all the time. No, I didn't call you buttholes. My mods are not buttholes. You're wonderful. Hey classy fellow. Oh, I'm glad you enjoy the show. Yeah. 
I am too. I, I hope it stays that way. I mean, if if the show ever does get more popular, I mean, when things get more popular, more buttholes come around. I don't know how I would handle that, but what if like the show got super popular, but it still didn't have a bunch of buttholes watching it? Like that would be cool. Like there just needs to be a place where like all the cool people can just watch a show and not be jerks, I guess. But I don't know. But I hope everyone's doing well tonight. I'm doing okay. My belly's warm because I ate the pot pie and Feeling okay. I'm tired. Oh, I'm a little tired, but not too tired. Not too tired to play some Zelda. I really need to like make some progress in that game somehow. We'll see. You're drinking some cranberry juice. Are you chasing it with anything? I don't think I've ever had cherry juice. I like cherries, but I didn't know that. I mean, I guess I knew that cherries could be juiced, but. Oh, I've never played any of the Hyrule Warriors games. I'm interested to play that new one that came out. But I've never played any of that style of game where you just beat up a bunch of dudes or whatever. It looks kind of fun, I guess. Yeah, it's supposed to be like a prequel or something. Oh, I'm in the snow. Still trying to figure out. I was trying to. Ah. Don't know what I'm doing. Yeah, it's hard to manage your time in real life. I understand that. There's so many things to do in this world. Oh, John. What is that? Frozen meat. Okay. Wow. It's amazing. I've so much of this game is unexplored for me, like I would never have thought there are still things that I have never collected, but I haven't spent much time in the icy and sandy parts, so I guess that makes sense. mess with those guys. It can be tedious if that's all you're doing, but you know, if you're just playing the game, I just kind of run into them, you know? It's like, oh, there's a rock. Or there's a circle of rocks and it's missing a rock, you know? I don't think I necessarily want to 100% the game, but... I 
I'd at least like to beat it. I am kind of at a point right now where I'm sort of lost. But like I thought I was making like good progress and then I was like the you know, a natural Breath of the Wild champion, but turns out not so much. They don't know what that was. Oh snap. Oh dang it. Oh wow. Dude. Well that's a pretty darn strong arrow. Shoot. Holy crap. Try, try again. Go this way. I still haven't played Mario Odyssey. I messed around with it, but That's not the best way to pay bills these days, huh? With the world all being weird and stuff. Weird, the world is very weird right now. Kind of doing some idle exploring here, seeing if I can't run into a shrine or something I've never seen before. Because I really haven't been spending a whole lot of time in these, this area. Yeah, people are pretty uptight these days. I just realized I was it was snowing in Animal Crossing and it's snowing in Zelda. I guess it's snow day here and it's me I'm Alex. It hardly ever snows here in actual Georgia though. It's been like three or four years since it's snowed here in Black Tree Falls. Hey, there's a fire. I bet there's some guys down there. Is that a house? I didn't do it. Oh look, a nice little cottage. There's any. Didn't I come here before? Hey, yeah, I've been here. There's like a book that I don't want to read. I 
Is there anyone by this fire? Oh, that sucks. When the hurricanes were coming through a couple weeks ago, we lost power here for a few days. That was pretty lame. I've got a few devices. I've got a tablet, a telephone, and then like a really old telephone. It's a smartphone, but it's old. When I was able to like stretch them out for three days, but it was pretty rough. I like to keep a bunch of ebooks and stuff on my old devices. So that if power goes out, then I can just read those and they don't use a whole lot of battery or anything. It's something to do. I want to get like a wind up USB thingy. But keep forgetting to get one, you know, just in case. And like if an apocalypse came or something, and like power grids went away forever, I'd spend like 20, you know, like a whole week cranking a crank so I could read a book for three days, you know? That's doable. So I want to get some like crankable USB things in case there's ever an apocalypse. But you never know. I mean, you really, I mean, who would have thought all this would be happening? So yeah, like you know, maybe all the power goes out forever. Maybe I want to get five of them. Yeah, that wouldn't be good. I want something that runs, you know, by like cranking it though, not like gas. I don't mind working for my power. I don't necessarily want to have to go like, you know, Mad Max or something fighting for like oil or gas or something. for it, you know, like, I have mixed feelings about, like, if the world is so crazy that you have to live, like, in an underground bunker, in my mind, I'm just like, well, it's over, you know, I'm not necessarily gonna take a cyanide pill, but, like, you know, if there's like people going around killing people or torturing people and I'm unsafe, maybe I'll take a cyanide pill, you know, like, cause I would rather be in control of my own destiny. But if like the whole world is fighting for food and stuff, like, I don't know, it'd be a real tough choice. Uh oh. 
This guy's sleeping. I wonder if I want to take him on. Probably should eat something at least before I do that. Is it really worth it? I mean, he is just sleeping. I don't know if I want to buck this guy. I don't know. Yeah, I try to be hopeful too, you know? I'm trying not to be a pessimist. Like, I'm, I don't necessarily, like, subscribe to, like, false optimism, you know? Like, I don't want to be like, oh, everything's going to be okay without knowing it. You know, but we here at It's Me, I'm Alex have been through absolute hell this past year. Like, I know everyone's had a rough year, and I'm not trying to, like, you know, have a pissing contest about, like, whose year's been rougher. Because I know it's been rough for everybody. But we've had a rough year. Like, the, the producer of my show ended up homeless. And, like, was living in a, basically a halfway home right now. You know, like, it's, it's crazy. But, like, my producer's really trying to stay optimistic, you know? Like, it's, it's been absolutely bonkers crazy. Like, holy crap. But, we're trying to stay optimistic about things. Cause like, you gotta keep moving forward, you know? But like... So many people these days are like... Ready to give up or being apathetic and stuff and like... You know, we all have to work together. Get through all of this crazy mess. It's a lot of work, and I know that I know that not everyone's pulling their own weight or whatever, but it's gotta be done. Hey, it's the Birdman. Sing me a song, you're the Birdman. Sing me a song tonight Cause we're all in the mood for a melody You got me feeling alright da 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 Wait, is this the guy that I was looking for? The whole time? Wait a minute. Hold on. Okay. Yeah, sing me a song. 
after the Birdman. Do it. That's a good question. I mean, I think that the bird people and the fish people could like work together to like. Oh, I gotta listen to him singing the second verse. Same as the first. The kingdom of Hyrule was once a land of lasting peace. A culture of such strength and wind and suffering did cease. But can lurk beneath the surface, strengthening its jaws. So the ancient people of Hyrule said, their efforts were fruit and an automated force. The help of her calamity by settling it at its source. For a giant babe is for power never ceased. Each of these titans was called a divine beast. And free built machines and hunted down their prey. These guardians were built to last so they could join the fray. To guard the beasts in battle, warriors were needed. So four champions pledged to see crown and defeated. Divine beast guardians, princes and knight, their plan to rout Garden was like a near target. And when Calamity Ganon reared its head, Hyrule rose against it, optimism of Hyrule and all of more incensed dead. Ganon raged and its assault boiling went head. It gnashed its teeth and thrashed about, but it was all too late. The guardians kept the heroes safe through every hour. The divine beast unleashed attacks that weaken Ganon's power. The hero with the ceiling sword struck the final blow, and the holy power of princess sealed Ganon's soul. And that is the story of the Brazen Attack. And Calamity Ganon 10,000. Years back. Thank you, Cass. It's a beautiful song. What's that? Some singing, buddy? No, 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 no. We're good. It's beautiful. Right? You think they would do something about that? Just let same thing keep happening over and over again. Hey, is that beetle up there? I think that's beetle. Dude. I got a beetle for you. Hey. Hey. Yeah, I thought you'd like that. 
Oh, totally. I've been saving it for you. Meat and rice bowl. Whoa. Right? Take it. Thank you. What are you selling? I'll take it. Yeah, yeah. All of them. Bam. Oh no, I'm good, Beetle. Heck yeah. Yeah, I don't mind all the different timelines and stuff. I like all the different stories and it doesn't hurt my feelings none that it, it's hard to match them up. Wonder if I can take these guys on. never been able to get into the DS Zelda games. I am not a fan of how they did the touch screen stuff on those at all. Dude, you just wasted all my apples. Crepes. This guy's giving me problems. Dang, is that all of them? Yeah, I've never played Skyward Sword much either. We've got a Wii Motion Plus control. I did not feel... I don't know. My preferred way to play Zelda is by pressing a button to do this stuff, not... I'm not super into the idea of like swinging a sword to play a video games. Like it doesn't. Like when I'm looking for immersion in video games, I don't want to have to like actually do the work or whatever. Just 
definitely want to sit there and press the buttons. And clever name. beaten this one yet but I'm still thinking it might be my favorite Zelda I'm loving it like I really do enjoy like how I, I love this game I'm just lost right now but I think it's a pretty darn good Zelda game silver metals oh that's pretty cool I'm glad you brought up Pokemon. Oh, thanks for the raid, Aiden Wood. That's really kind of you. The word of the day is tootle. Too gently or repeatedly on a flute or flute like instrument. Nice. Hey. Hey, everyone. Pleased to meet you. My name is Alex, and. This show is called It's Me, I'm Alex. Um, Leonard, do you want to introduce yourself? Hello, my name is Leonard, and I have purple hair, and I wear a red shirt with a 7 on it. Anything else? My wife is named Tractor, and I love her very much. Alright. Seymour? Yes. You got anything you wanna add? Uh Nope. Okay. That's Seymour over there. And uh Sally, you wanna say hello? Hello. And that's Grace outside. But uh yeah, pleased to meet everyone. Thanks again for the raid, Aiden, and uh yeah, this is It's Me, I'm Alex. On this show, we like to do stuff. We do all kinds of stuff. So, like, if you're into things, like, this is probably the place to be. So, heck yeah. Hey, wavy lines. Yeah, it's, I'm pleased to meet you all. Oh, well, we do stuff and things here on the show, you know? So, like, you know, whatever you're into, you'll probably find it eventually. We sure do, don't we? Yeah, I, I play all sorts of games, retro games, new games. Sometimes I draw pictures. I've been known to sing a song or two. I like talking to people. Mario 3, yeah. Fish tanks, eventually. 
We do hope to get a fish here on the show eventually. But yeah. I love hanging out and talking to people. I got a nice little community of friends who watch the show and we all kind of hang out and have a good time and everyone's nice. Ooh, a snail would be cool. Heck yeah. I'm totally into the idea of having a snail. So, uh, yeah, welcome all you new folks. Um, if you have any questions, let me know. I'll be glad to answer them. And, um, uh, I don't bite. Mm. I don't bite. I really don't. I don't. Alright. Yeah, so I'm playing Breath of the Wild. Kinda stuck. I don't know. Just kind of wandering around and rambling on. And that's probably okay. So, heck yeah. But, uh, welcome everyone. Hey, a fairy. Yeah, it's way too early to name. A snail if I had one. to the next divine beast, but I can't seem to be taking the steps needed in which to do that. Aw, well thank you for bringing all your friends over, Aiden. I really appreciate that. I still need to check out that Among Us game. I still have never even touched it. So much just even watched anyone play it before. I've heard a lot about it. Oh, that's kind of you. I'll look into it. If we get a snail, can we name it Seymour? Seymour? No. Okay, Seymour says no. Oh well. Where is that? It's up there. That guy's still sleeping. She was. Maybe I'll take him on. I'll do it. Hey, pretty Blake. You think I should let him sleep? I, I mean, if that was me, I would, I'd be mad if someone just like woke me up. Yeah, he does. I bet he has little stinky toots. I just. Walk over here real quietly. Real quiet. Shh. Make sure 
there's nothing. Shh. Yeah. Make sure there's no cool rocks over here or anything. You think I could do that? Oh, he moved his hand. What if I put his hand in like a giant glass of warm water? Do you think he would like tinkle on himself? Yeah. I know this game has a good physics engine. I don't know if it has like giant glasses of water. That'd be a funny prank though. Oh crap. Oh dang it. Now I gotta fight him. the wrong button there. There we go. I hate that I had to destroy him, but like we got at least we got a toenail out of it. Oh no, I'm not that. Yeah, we got some toenails. I'm not against naps. I I guess I don't like naps very much for myself because. I don't like to waste time, but... That was exhilarating. Pretty cool collection of tunnel clippings. At the end of each school year, I like to ask my teachers for one of their toenail clippings. And then I put it in my scrapbook. Rumble Stoltzkin, you're from the anti amp Defense Force. Oh. Uh, nothing suspicious here. No, not indeed. Wow. 
I've got all of my teachers through the fourth grade and my fifth grade teacher was like nope and I said please and he was like Alex get out of here go home and uh, never come back and that was that was sad and I've been afraid to ask ever since I thought it was like a cool thing you know like look I got my all my teachers toenail clippings through elementary school but fifth grade teacher was like no Thank you. It's a fun little game, Birdie. I recommend it. made by a company called Nintendo and they're a Japanese publisher of video games they also make a video game series called the Super Mario Brothers and it's about these brothers who like rescue princesses Yeah, I think I've heard about that. They make like fancy playing cards. Alrighty, thank you, Grumble Cell Skin. I appreciate the service that you provide. I'll probably butcher the name of it, but it's some fancy kind of card called Havrufunda. Havrufunda cards or something. I don't think they're for playing poker. They're for playing some game that's way too complicated for me to understand, I'm sure. But that's okay. We're just exploring. I don't know this area very well. Hey look, it's got birch trees. It's a pretty good shape. Brian triangles yuck. progress yet. I need to run into a shrine or something. This forest looks all lopsided. Great, 
it's starting to rain. I don't know if any of you new folks around here are into Animal Crossing, but that's another game that I'm, I'll be playing a heck of a lot. I'm actually currently playing Animal Crossing for the GameCube, Animal Crossing for the Nintendo Wii, Animal Crossing for the Nintendo 3DS, and Animal Crossing for the Nintendo Switch Entertainment System. And I combine them all into one big Alex fill. And I love it. Oh, that seems like a cool way to play the game, Grumble's Tell Skin. Leonard, what's your favorite gaming system? Wavy Lines writes in, Dear Leonard, what's your favorite gaming system? Um, my favorite gaming system is the Commodore 64. Commodore 64, really? Yes. That's cool. What's your favorite Commodore 64 game? The Bernstein Bears Teach Numbers. Really? Yep. 100%. I give that game five Leonards. Okay. Cool. Oh, five Leonards out of infinite Leonards. Mifa's grace is ready. You can never have enough Leonards. What is this thing? This looks like it needs to be messed with somehow. Huh. <gasps> Is that right, wavy lines? And that's like your favorite game ever, Leonard? Yep, of all time. I was playing it just earlier. Oh. And it only gets five Leonards out of like infinite Leonards? Yep. What's your favorite food? My favorite food is... Um... I can't say it. You can't say it? No. Why? Because we'll get banned. What? What are you, what are you talking about? Actually, no. Like, just talk to me after the- what? 
I'm doing you a solid, Alex. Okay. Weird. The blood moon rises once again. What? Nothing. Just you're always being weird on my show. Well, well. Okay, I'll say it. No, don't, dude. Don't get me banned. I don't even. Like, I have, like, a feeling that it wouldn't get me banned. It's probably something to do with your wife. Maybe. Well, no offense, but... Like... Just say it. Freshly cut grass. I knew it. Please don't report me, Leonard. Can't believe. Dude! I, I just got here. Back off. Actually, I'm not. I've got an offline playthrough that I'm playing master mode and it kind of feels like that, but... All my mooks are like... Powered up. It seems... They don't like how I've spent my time just lollygagging and they've all powered up. Ugh. You know, because sometimes I just play the game and collect mushrooms and walk around. Yeah, it's really tough. Like, I do just, like, putting on the game and just, like, messing around and hanging out with people. I like to make progress, but it's such a good game for, like, lollygagging, you know? But there's just been too much of that with me lately. I, I want to make some progress, but kind of just stuck. It really is. I can't complain. That's a good question, wavy lines. Do 
to be honest. I'm not super into lollipops. They are like one of the most unfulfilling snacks of all time. Aw, that sounds cute, Grumble Still Skin. Little kitties. Yeah. I haven't even run into one of those guys in a little while. Probably easier to find them and then, huh? What is that noise? Hey, there's a fairy. I can use that. Thanks. Yeah, I was curious about the edge of the map and there is one and I like the way they did it. It's just like a giant mountain that's impossible to climb and so it's pretty cool neat yeah neat even yeah it's a nice little natural barrier Do you give this game Leonard? I give Breath of the Wild two Leonards. Two? That's my final final score. Okay. Two Leonards, huh? What gets the most Leonards? My wife. Duh. How many, how many Leonards does your wife get? Infinity plus one. Oh, that makes sense. to find a shrine or something. It's not looking good. It's over here. I'll check my map and see if there's a shrine that I haven't done that I noped out of. 
That's a shrine I didn't do. Might as well do it. Gotta be productive. Hopefully it does. It's not one that's boring and tedious. Never know though. That's a good question. What? Wavy Lions writes in, Dear Leonard, are you a pure mathematics theoretical mathematician who believes in infinities larger than natural infinity? Um, I just love my wife a whole bunch is all. Oh. Ah, uh, you would think, huh? All right, so I need to get a ball over there into that thing. Did that work? Close. Not close enough. Let's try this. There we go. Oh god. Hey Seth or Jessica. I like this game too. Oh god, those guys are gonna try to get me. Dude! Put on a guardian outfit. Good at math, right? Yep. What is like your opinion about the whole infinity thing? Oh, stupid. Oh. Sounds like a bummer, Jessica.
right to one of those blocks as bonk blocks is boxes block the laser Ow. there we go all of you new folks and I'm not just saying this but you know just cause like I want people to like come around like unvicariously but like like I like you guys I hope you come back like I like having good people around I'll try to make a good show and stuff to watch while y'all hang out, but like... Wavy Lines has been around the block. What am I supposed to do? Like, I think those are... Time stoppy things. Yes. Okay. Oh, that was dumb. Where is it going to put me? What did Cinderella do when she got to the ball? What did she say? Um... I don't know. I bet that's a- is that a joke? I bet she said... Here's looking at you, kid. Oh, it does look like you can, huh? Oh, junk. Thanks for the hot tip, Grumple Stoltzkin. And I need a ball. Oh my god. The ball's all the way over there. Yikes. Silly me. to get this ball over there. Huh. I'm gonna have to use my noggin a couple of times it looks like. Dang it. Okay. Run past this laser. Get over here. Put the ball down. Okay, I got it. Got it. Run past here. 
but the thing blocks that thing. Block it, block it. Go, 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 go. Legend of Zelda. Bam. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, yay, there's no more puzzle to solve. Oh, thank you guys. I just had to use my noggin as all. Use my little noggin. Well, that's like a little bit of progress. You got an orb and everything. Nice. Let's see. Oh, dang it. We were having fun. That sound. When you hear that horn, that means that it's time to go. Shoot. Oh well. Well. Aww. Yeah. No. You're very welcome. Thank you guys for watching my stream. Thanks to Aiden Wood for the raid, and it was a pleasure meeting all of you new folks. Oh, I know it was abrupt. Leonard! Oh, Leonard Command. Yeah. No, I know it was abrupt, but we can't... When the horn sounds, it means that it's time to go. Leonard! I forgot about the letter command. Oh well. But no, I, I'm very pleased to meet all of you new folks. That is a, a pleasure. I hope you come back. I think that, uh, I think I'll be doing one more stream tonight. And this is just a little break, but we have to take a break, and I'll be back. Uh, but I, I let everyone know on the, the It's Me I'm Alex Discord when I'm streaming because I'm not quite on a schedule right now, so you, you know that's the best place to find out when the. When the stream is. Is there not a. I guess a Discord command doesn't work. Huh. There's a link down below on the thing on my page if anyone wants to join. It's a really fun place to be. But, um. Yeah, it's a pleasure meeting you all. I'm gonna take a break and I'll be back. Uh, Probably in about 30 minutes. So, uh, yeah. Um, I'm gonna have another little snack and um, drink some water, and I'll see y'all then. Um, until then, don't forget.